Why can't I find that food, bro? I think that's the only thing I can hold you. No way. Not to sleep. Yeah, I still feel my body shutting down slowly. And you thinking it's not because I don't want to talk. That's like my body's just saying, yo, my nigga, you, you drank, you had fun, sleep. So what are we going to do if you took me to like the business class shower? <laughs> Yo, clearly, Bumi is really having having it hard. Like, she's literally struggling to move on from this situation. She's really, really having a hard time. By the way, guys, welcome back to Life Updates with T. Thank you so much for tuning in and thank you so much for joining me. If you're new to this channel, welcome welcome and welcome please do make sure that you hit the subscribe button you turn on your notification bell you like you comment you share you watch you watch my ads and just basically do the most guys i'm going through it all i am going through it all right now because this flu is really killing me I have been telling you guys since yesterday that I'm not feeling really well and it just keeps getting worse, you know. So I I might not be able to keep up with the consistency because, yeah, I'm going through the most. I'm not okay at all. I'm not okay. I hope to get well soon. So you know what? I can come back here full force once again. But yeah, now let's talk about Mbumi. Guys, it's giving desperation, to be honest. It's really, literally giving desperation. Because why is Mbumi doing this to herself? I don't understand why. She was the one who ended up deciding, right, to leave the situation um, simply because Jared couldn't really choose. But eventually, like, he made it clear about who he likes and about who he wants to be with right he made it very clear and then he decided that he wants to be with liema and ever since that day honestly ever since all of this had, had happened they've been like all of them they've been about their business Bumi has been on her own and then jared and liema have been together moving on together so now I feel like alcohol is really, really a problem because it's it seems as if every Thursday and Saturdays we'll, we will have to deal with something like this. So at that point, I just felt like, you know what, baby girl should just go up at the head of house room and just find some rest and sleep because you cannot keep on embarrassing yourself like this. Jared, I don't know how many times, I don't know how many times Jared told her, told her that he wanted to sleep last night. Like he kept on telling her that, you know, what? it's not like I don't want to talk or I don't want to have a conversation with you, but I am tired. But she kept on going on and on and on and on about, yeah, uh, when uh, you never came to me. And offered me a juice or did this and this i mean like why are we still discussing that we only meet by the corner there when we, was, we are smoking and stuff like that like all of that is really not necessary and worse before that con conversation when they went to bed she was having a conversation with liema and jared about her not uh about Jared being not being his guy her kind of guy like she wouldn't go for someone like Jared and she's not even jealous when she sees them together because she she came to realize that um her and Jared eventually wouldn't wouldn't work because Jared seemed to be more complete with Liam than with her and also 
simply because Jared says a lot of things and to her they don't sound funny but with Liema, Liema is always laughing at anything that Jared says and during that conversation Jared looked tired and bored at the same time you know obviously the only person who was participating in that conversation with her was Liema but Jared seemed to be tired and bored and Mina in my mind I was like girl just please wrap it up wrap it up like all of those talks they're honestly not necessary at this point because there's nothing left for you to say that would actually make Jared or Liam change their minds when I just try and move on because you said you want to you want to move on and you want to remove yourself and guys worst part about all of this is that Jared and Liema were doing just fine together. I'm talking about before she became a part of it. They were doing really, really fine. And then she ended up inserting herself in this situation. And right now that she was not picked, it's a problem. Because clearly it seems like she's not going to let go. She's not going to let go. At this point, I'm just like, you know what? Let this show end because we cannot be experiencing this every Thursday or Friday or even Saturdays. Like anytime they drink alcohol, we have to experience something like this. We have to experience Bumi being in court, you know, with Jared. And also, some of the things that she was saying there by the table were not necessary. Like, were really not necessary because I felt like... She's indirectly, she's indirectly insulting or rather looking down, looking, looking down on Jared because she said a whole lot of things that about Jared being not, uh, his kind, her kind of guy about Jared, like being someone that she'd never go for and stuff like that. And also talk about her past relationships that she's never been in a relationship with things are not taken serious always things are straightforward and she always dates people that know what they really want so basically jared is the opposite of that that's what she's saying but she's right she's right because i mean time and time again you could see that jared is a very confused guy very confused human being so like she's some of the things that she said are right and are correct but we said at the wrong time you know all of that was not necessary she should just go about her business footy i feel like she's it's it's better that she won't head of house she should have just went upstairs in that head of house room and sleep and rest you know rather than having to disturb or sound and look desperate simply because she hasn't really moved on it's not easy to you know to break up with someone or to separate with someone but at the end of the day you need to know how to control yourself around that person that's just how i feel so yeah guys that will be the end of my video thank you so much for watching and thank you so much for stopping by Please do not forget to hit the subscribe button, to like, to share, to comment, and just basically do the most, guys. Um, I'm going through it all, <laughs> like I said. I'll probably see you guys again when I post more videos. I'm not sure if I'm going to manage to post as much as I do today, but yeah, I guess I'll see you later. Thank you so much for stopping by once again. Bye.